guys, Mr. Sarabian here. So, um, I'm outside, not in my usual paleo garb, and you're probably wondering why the heck that I have this Omaha steak box here. Well, take a look at this. Okay, here. No, this is a this is a beautiful teaching opportunity right now, so I'm taking full advantage of it. All right. What is it doing? It's it's sitting. It's 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 not exactly sure what to make of this styrofoam box right now. I feel so uncomfortable in this home now. Just putting it out there. Bit, this is some kind of this is Go ahead. I'm looking at it as some kind of a rat snake. Okay. I think the best this is gonna sound really stupid, but I think the best thing to actually do is to get some of the crap out of its way. Because it looks like it's wrapped itself around it, so I think the best right, course on, of action right, is attention. Because remember, you respond to vibrations and movement. See? Okay, so see how, it's, see how it's see how it's see how it moved the same way that I moved. But it sees me right now. That's the thing. All it's, right, back it's, up, back, back up. No, 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 no. I, I got it. I got it. I got it. I think just grab its damn head and. The problem is the snake is going to react faster than I do. Because I know my reflexes, but I also All know right. snake reflexes, too. Just, I hate, oh. I know, I know. Trust me, you think I don't? I think it's just, I think it's more freaking out. All right. There we go. Alright, got that out of the way. Just going to nudge it. Like, yeah, it's fine, who cares? Right there Let's get that gets the blood pumping. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah, a snake inside of our house. I have no idea how it got there. I have no idea what it was doing in my father's uh, Princeton Nassau trophy shelf. I have no clue. But either way, I would like to point out too that I am terrified of snakes. So rather than killing it, which I'm sure some of you might be thinking, is that what I'm going to do right now? No, we're going to set it free. There's a couple of reasons why. Number one, snakes are a really important role in our ecosystem. Much like insects, they're responsible for eating a lot of the, shall we say, unpleasant animals that some of us have around the house from time to time. For one thing, mice. So this guy, I don't know what species, but I imagine it's probably a species of rat snake in some form or another. But we actually do need snakes. As much as we don't like them, we need them. They're important in the ecosystem. They're secondary consumers. So they are eating some of the unpleasant animals that are your standard herbivores. So how exactly am I going to let it go? Well, you can see that I'm pretty much as protected as I possibly can be, especially considering the fact, like I said, I'm terrified of snakes. So all I'm going to do, because snakes respond to vibrations rather than direct sound, because they actually don't have ears, believe it or not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the lid. I'm going to tip the box forward. Okay. And I'm just going to gently knock it in the back and hopefully, hopefully, snake will just go into the brush and if it decides to come towards me I'm running in the opposite direction. Are we ready for this? The snake was a lot scarier inside than it is out here. So, okay, I actually feel kind of now. I'm actually afraid of snakes, so this is actually a big thing for me right now. And I firmly believe that if you're afraid of something, you really should try to confront it to what's in your comfort zone. So that's why I've actually been working with little snakes here and there. And the funny thing is I've been working, I've worked with alligators, so this shouldn't really freak me out. But I'm going to try something. See, now it feels threatened by me because I gave it a little bit of a touch. So now it's slithering away. Arabian, but how
how old is 